Welcome to My Long Island TV. From Manhasset to Montauk, we have traveled our communities to bring you the following events. I'm your host, Waldo Cabrera. My Long Island TV starts now. I own Trina Rose Designs. We make mineral gel wax candles. I'm also an event corner coordinator for LA Art Show. And um, we started it because we love craft shows and we were getting tired of seeing people selling 401k or life insurance and we wanted the true artists that were originally at craft shows to come to them. So we started it and it's been a success ever since. We want it to be a win-win for everybody. We want to bring customers to the vineyard. So we want the vineyards, uh, the customers that have a great time at the vineyard and see all the unique true artists of Long Island. Right here at uh, Whisper Vineyards in St. James. So a lot of people didn't know about it and it's a great little vineyard right here in town. So it's perfect. Oh, it's a beautiful day. It's a beautiful location. I can't believe they have a vineyard in St. James. We had a little red, very little red, a little white because it's summer, and we even had a little beer. It was, it's perfect. Most vineyards don't have or they don't offer uh, you know, any kind of beer, so it was good today, yes. It's very impressive what she's done. She's brought together handcrafters, artists, artisans, and she's made sure that everyone is an authentic artist, you know, everyone makes their own items, their own creations, and that's very hard to find anymore these days. I like to think that people are still interested in um, items, crafts, art that is made by people on Long Island. Um, who, are, who is better to support the artists than the people who live around and with them? I have a shop on Etsy, it's called The Laughing Potter, and I sell a lot of the items that Sam, you know that like that, that I make, but um, it's not the same because I have to bring stuff to shows. And if somebody buys it on Etsy and I sold it at the show, that's not good for me. It's not good for the person. They get frustrated. So, yeah. So a lot of the stuff that I have at the shows I don't have on my website. I like the vineyard setting. Drink some wine, buy some art. All of my pieces I find from antique shops, and I break apart um, pins, earrings, rings, and I take old pieces that I see that I can make new life. There's a story behind all of these pieces. So sometimes you can't wear them, so it's always nice to make them into something new that you can wear them. I love the hand-crafted stuff. I'm drawn to that. Um, I particularly like the, uh, the bottles, the chimes. Um, really neat story behind that, how they're created. And the variety of styles is pretty impressive. I love it. I love the versatility and the energy. Um, everybody's got their, their story, uh, their inspiration, and their own fork in the road as far as how it got started. So it's very, very inspiring and very refreshing.